just a little message for me. You're a lovely little art teacher uh, sitting here in my home studio. If you've ever wondered what it looked like, uh, this is where I do my creative time when I have some time to spare or just when I want to get my artsy on. So I want to give you a little update on what's going on. Uh, I've got the ATC cards for fifth grade. I'm posting them on Twitter. That would be Twitter, not Twitter. Even in a video, I still can't talk. Hmm. Imagine that. Anyway, posting those ATC cards on Twitter. I'm also working on getting them together in a slide presentation that I will be sharing and pushing out to you at Google Classroom. The other thing I want you want to encourage you to do, try to do something artsy every day. Work on those drawing skills. Everybody has something different that they love. So find something that you love and work on it. I personally Pizza, rocking the Pizza Cat shirt. And at two o'clock every day, I want to invite you to join me. Steve Harpster, who was our author that visited, of Harp Tunes, is doing a daily live drawing at two o'clock. You can search him up on YouTube, or I believe you can also find those same videos on our classroom link. So, reminder Steve Harpster, Harp Tunes, two o'clock every day. I'm going to post my drawings that I do. Um, hope you'll post yours. Send them to me. Email them to me. That would be wonderful. I would also love to be able to share those on Twitter and maybe even send some to Steve Harpshire. We still email each other back and forth and I tell him how much my kids still love his books and still love his videos. Um, the other thing that I'm really wanting to share with you today is a quick simple idea for a project. If you're doing a book report, if you're doing a creative writing project, think about getting artsy with it. This is one of the cards that we received in the ATC swap, and it put the biggest smile on my face. It's so simple. Find a magazine laying around, cut out a face, and add the setting or the background. If you're writing a medieval story, Give it medieval garb. This kind of looks renaissance to me. If you're writing about an alien in your short story, give it an alien. That'd be cool. Put it on a planet. Get some color on it. All kind of things. Things we've been practicing. Practice your shading if you've been shady. So, look in a classroom. Look on Twitter. And I will try to post some more videos because... I'm really horrible at it. And I think you're probably getting a really big laugh right now because I hope my personality is still coming through even through this horrible, awful video. So, love you guys. Stay safe. Do some art. Share with me. Only thing I have running around here are the fur babies. Nobody to talk to. So, I really need somebody to email me. Share your work. I miss you guys. Take care. Bye.